hope everyone is doing well. Today I feel kind of blissful, like I'm in paradise. Seriously, I am. Like I am blessed to be here. To be in this, this room here, doing a fragrance review on this camera. I feel great to make this review in this channel. It's blissful. So talking about that, I have a review for you and it's called Blissful Spartan by Berry Fragrances. Now this is an interpretation of Le Bleu Paradise Garden by Jean-Paul Gaultier. <laughs> I wanted to be more French. Croissant. There we go. Croissant. Nasal passages. Croissant. <laughs> but anyways, yeah. Does it... Does Blissful Spartan does make a wow impact on the fragrance clone houses? I don't know. You be the, I'll be the judge of that later on. But first, let's go with the notes. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you to Blissful Spartan by Berry Fragrances. Now this one is a beautiful fragrance and I got the top notes here. Green notes, watery notes, mint and ginger. The middle notes are coconut, fig and salt. Now the base of the notes is tonka bean, sandalwood and a one Spartan with a sword and a shield and a beautiful bronze helmet. I'm just playing. Yeah, so that's it. All right, you already heard the notes. But first, I just gotta let you know that I sprayed this on while you were listening to the notes just to get a nice input of the dry down. So let's go ahead and spray this on and I'll tell you what I think as an initial spray. So I'm gonna spray one here in my arm, then one in the air. Okay. I smell the green notes. I do smell the mint and ginger. Very nice, very subtle. I like that. It gives you nice that, that nice subtle input of a nice fresh green fragrance. Wow. Now I know why a lot of people like this fragrance. It gives you that sweetness as well. The tonka bean hits first because you can smell the tonka bean. It then comes with the green notes. The green notes hit, and then comes the, the mint and the ginger. Now, let's go with the dry down. The dry down, I smell a little bit of the fig. The fig is nice and sweet, also subtle. I don't smell the salt, and I don't smell the coconut. So, one of those two ingredients, I don't smell. It's kind of like, more of like, um, um, a little bit more richer on the sweeter side, if you know what I mean. It's more subtle on the sweetness, but it's also strong on the green notes. So it gives you that nice refresh, kind of like a, like you got out of the shower kind of thing. It just feels great. Now, when it comes to the dry down, I start smelling a little bit more tropical kind of smell. A real nice, subtle, sweet, tropical smell. It's really nice. Tell you the truth. I like this. It's real nice. When it comes to the longevity. Longevity, um, eight hours. To tell you the truth, I've been wearing this. You can tell, I've been wearing this. Um, all in all, a lot of people think that the smell is more of like a going out of the shower kind of smell. Mm. I I disagree. I think it's more of like because it doesn't smell like you got out of the shower with soap and everything and you smell fresh. No, no, no. I mean what with what, what that means is that for me, having that smell of a freshness sort of scent, it gives you that cherry on top kind of smell. There you go, a cherry top kind of smell. So when it comes to the dry down it starts kicking in like a more tropical kind of smell. And that I think that's the reasons why a lot of people like this. The opening DNA, it smells like a Le Mans. It does. It does smell like a Le Mans, but it gives you that garden green scent that everybody's talking about. And 
for me, when I hit the dry down, it's more of a tropical, coconutty, kind of like you're in the beach somewhere. That's my smell. On the initial spray, gives you that that John Paul Gutierrez kind of DNA in the opening. Like it. It's pretty cool. Now, I told you about the longevity, eight hours plus. Now let's go with the Siage. Siage, amazing. A lot of people like this. I got a couple sprays, one here, two, three, and four. That is for me, that's sufficient for me. A lot of the, the um, a lot of my coworkers like it. It has a little bit of a fruity smell. I do get that. I do get that fruity smell, that tropical scent going on. Um, is it a wow factor? Not necessarily. I think that you can have other different fragrances out there that could make this fragrance. But Barry did a fantastic job, make, like inspired fragrance like this. He did. Now, can you get this fragrance, like to use it as a normal day, like every every day, like a daily user? Absolutely, you can wear this every day, no problem. A lot of people say that it's for only for the summer, whatever. No, this one does not offend anybody. You're not gonna go to HR. This is a great, great fragrance that. It won't take you to HR. It'd probably be like real subtle, nice and inviting. I think you're gonna get compliments in the office place if you do work there. Um, but if you don't, if you work in some blue collar job, like, you know, like being in a restaurant business or doing other stuff, this smell is pretty strong. I really do like this. And a lot of people will compliment you when you go in your blue collar job. Now on the white collar job, a couple sprays would do it. That's about it. But a lot of people say it smells like a fresh out of the shower kind of fragrance. I don't agree. I think it's more of a nice, sweet, subtle, not in the shower, getting out of the shower fragrance. Now, when it comes to um, scoring this from zero out of 10, this one, I believe, deserves a 7.5. The reasons why is that this one, it smells like a Le Mans. It does smell like a Le Mans fragrance. If you're into that stuff, great. I'm not into that stuff. I'm more into of, a, of um, getting more innovative and getting changes, not like the Mall DNA. I think if other fragrance houses change their attitudes and change the way their DNA of their certain kind of like old school fragrance are like Dior or Chanel or or maybe other different fragrances out there like Armani, start changing their fragrance and changing their DNA and making something different instead of buying, like making other different fragrances with the same DNA. It's I know, I know it's a lucrative business, and I think that a lot of these people just want to sell, 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 sell. They don't want to be innovative and make beautiful, different fragrances, and and it, it costs money. I understand, but for me, having a little mall fragrance, I could get a little mall fragrance anywhere. Like, you can do anything. You can just buy a little mall bottle for maybe less than a hundred dollars. Okay. And you're gonna smell great and you're gonna smell sweet. Now, what this fragrance reminds me of, of another clone house that I know of, is 9 p.m. I think a lot of these fragrance reviewers out there have sold this before and they have reviewed this fragrance. It smells exactly like that, but a little bit greener. This is a little bit greener, but it has that same DNA. And that's the reasons why I'm at, I'm telling all the fragrance houses out there. If you want to be innovative and not a cash cow and start giving us different kind of good smelling fragrances that are, are innovative, dude, I'm all in it. I'll pay the big bucks for it. And trust me, 
I won't be disappointed because I know it's different. I know it's a different DNA. So, for all in all, that one gets a 7.5 in my in my scoring. And I think that Berry Fragrances nailed it once again when it comes to this fragrance. Now, when 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 everything comes to show, go get yourself one of these bottles. I think this one is pretty cool. If you're into the mall and you can't afford 200 bucks for a bottle, get one of these, Blissful Spartan. It's only $47.99, it smells exactly the same. Believe me, I've been doing this for almost three years. I know this. This is a real nice fragrance. You won't be disappointed. I think this one is more greener and the same sweetness as a, as a Lamal, but it gives you that green kind of scent. So yeah, if you really are interested, the link will be down below and just press, or just put promo code LX20 and then we'll give you 20% off, off the bat. And um, if you want a trash bear, you can use, also use uh, the LX20. So if you want to test it out first, before you go inside uh, to get the shark, <laughs> get yourself a travel travel spare and or if not go with the big boy get a bottle you won't be disappointed and it's only $47.99 but minus the 20% off so let's do it baby go in it go inside the, the link trust me you won't be disappointed all right so I'll wrap it up and like I always say spray on and have a fantastic day Goodbye for now, and I hope to see you at the next review. Goodbye.